Hi guys, Rob from Rob's Model Cars and welcome back to the channel. We're back again today with another new model review and this is a really special one as you can see by the title. Now this is the brand new Frontier Koenig said Regera and this is the fully opening resin model uh, and this is a replica of the first car that was delivered in the US. Um, everyone's nicknamed that Cherry Bomb so that is the uh, full candy red and carbon fibre top. Now before we uh, go any further with this review, a uh, huge thank you to Rob from Car Models in Austria for giving me a very big discount on this model. Um, be sure to go and check out his website, he's got a fantastic uh, range of high-end models, some real stunners on there and some of the best worldwide prices for his models I believe. Um, so yeah, go and check out carmodels.com. Uh, and Rob will be happy to help you out. Now, this obviously came all the way from Austria here to me in Australia. Uh, it was packaged really well, no problems at all, uh, and I will be ordering more models through Car Models as well. So, a uh, huge thank you to Car Models for this particular model. All right, so let's start the review. Comes in these beautiful quilted style boxes by Frontier. Uh, I think these are the best in the business as far as presentation of a model. Uh, it just has a label on the end of the box which says what model's inside. Now it has a lift off lid. Uh, all these boxes are all felt lined as well. As I say, I think they're some of the best display boxes in the business. It does come with a certificate of authenticity. Now this model is limited to 298 pieces and I have number 23. Um, it does have another booklet that came in the top of the case, a Frontier Art booklet, and this basically ex explains the process of how the model was built. Um, it does say on here uh, 6,800 processes, so that could be anything from uh, making one of the resin parts to painting it to adding decals to whatever. So that's a lot of processes, and there's more than 680 parts uh, that makes up one of these uh, Regera models. Now as a custom model builder myself, I know how hard it is to, to build models to this level of detail, so uh, I can sort of understand why the price of these models are what they are. Now Car Models I think has some of the best prices out of anyone worldwide for these Frontier Art models. Uh, Frontier Art directly did offer me this model, uh, but it was so much more expensive, so I got it through car models. Anyway, if we flip the front down, this is the gorgeous Koenigsegg Regera Cherry Bomb. Now this is a full opening model which I'll show you. Uh, it does come with a plexiglass display case uh, and it comes on a beautiful new style uh, mounting base as well. So we'll get this out of the box, uh, we'll put it on the turntable and we'll have a closer look. Um, the model doesn't actually arrive like this, it does have lots of packaging straps uh, and little pieces of tape to hold all the opening panels uh, together and close during transport. Uh, and as I say, this came all the way from Austria with absolutely no damage at all. So uh, definitely go and check out carmodels.com uh, for their extensive range of high-end and rare models. So let's start this review. Okay, so first impressions of this model. It's been a long time since I've received a model uh, where I've just been absolutely blown away. I do have a lot of high-end resin models, but this one uh, really put a smile on my face when I got it. So hopefully the camera is doing this candy apple red color justice. Um, it is an absolutely amazing looking model in the flesh. Um, so let's start with the base. It comes on this uh, new style uh, brown leather base with a plexiglass uh, floating top and then the model is mounted through that. Uh, it has a beautiful uh, Regera logo on the base also and the limited name plate as well which is 23 of 298. Now you probably can remove this model from the base um, but being that it's a resin model and really quite expensive. I'm going to leave this one on the base. This won't be coming off the base. Um, so yeah, really nice presentation for this full opening Koenigsegg Regera model. Uh, and as I say, 
The details are just absolutely amazing on this model and you'll see in a moment. So let's talk about the exterior first. Uh, it does have this big carbon fibre front splitter, little side canards as this model has the ghost package which has the little winglets on the back. Um, there is a little bit of the, uh, the, or the I should say the carbon fibre is straight, there's a little bit of waviness in these pieces. I'd say these have been the hydro dip method, uh, but the carbon on the hood is centre matched and out of decals. So there's absolutely no waviness in the carbon through the top of the model. Uh, just some of these add on parts here. So um, as I say, a little bit of waviness there, but it, it's, it doesn't detract too much from the model. It's pretty good. Now it's got a beautiful little photo etch Koenigsegg crest on the hood. Uh, you do have the red stripe through the middle and it is centre match this carbon fibre both ways. Uh, there's a little bit of carbon details on these little air outlet edges uh, and they've done a fantastic job on the headlamps as well for this model. So we're off to a great start, really impressive. Uh, there is a little bit of carbon fibre on the stalk of the mirror. Uh, that has a little bit of wavy pattern as well, but it's also following the curvature of the mirror arm, so uh, I'm not going to complain too much about that one. Of course, the whole air intake on the side is all in carbon fibre, uh, as is the side skirt sill. Uh, that's like that on both sides. Uh, and the back of the model is all carbon fibre as well, so... We do have the uh, number plate on here, which is photo etched metal. Uh, the little carbon fibre lights above that. We've got the big heat exchanger outlet for the electric motor on the back, which has the Regera logo in the top of it. Not sure whether you can see that. That's pretty amazing. Uh, and the rest of it's all carbon fibre, and you've got your Acropovic exhaust outlets coming through the rear diffuser also. So yeah, the paint is absolutely stunning on this model, uh, and so is the carbon fibre. So we've got carbon fibre all the way through the top of the model as well. Uh, as I said, this is the ghost package with the little side winglets, uh, and you've got this large air scoop uh, into the engine bay as well. Now the carbon pattern is a little bit wavy on this piece as well, so I guess that one's been hydro dipped also. Um, but it doesn't detract too much from the model. Uh, because as you'll see it's got a few more features and uh, special tricks to it. Now the wheels are replicated awesome, uh, they're all in carbon fibre pattern as well. Nice little attention to detail to the centre lock nut in the middle uh, and of course excellent job on the brake calipers and brake rotors front and rear on this model. So overall the, the exterior uh, finishing paint quality uh, I think is exceptionally good. I really don't have any complaints at all uh, and hopefully you shouldn't have any complaints with a model worth this much money. So that's really really impressive. Now let's get to the fun things, the opening part. So it does have a removable roof. Uh, this is all in carbon fibre as well. Um, it is centre matched as you can see. Uh, and it does have the red in interior colour uh, on the underside. So that's a, that's a very light little piece. Uh, it is carbon fibre on the inside as well, as you can see, uh, just not full gloss like the outside. So that's the first removable piece, is this hard top. Now the model looks really cool with the roof removed because you can see all the detail of the interior. Uh, I'll probably display it most of the time with the roof removed um, but yeah absolutely awesome and you can see the interior is absolutely packed with detail now let's show you something that is unique to any model that I've ever bought before uh, and that is the windows on this car so check this out that's right the windows go down now I don't have any other models that this happens windows go down. That is an absolutely awesome added feature in this model and they really didn't have to do that but they chose to take this model to that that next level and do something like that. 
Now it is resin, so it, it does feel a little bit delicate, but the doors open and swing out as per the real car. We'll open this one around. So we just lift those out and they will just hinge forward. So yeah, they don't feel real delicate. I mean, obviously you've got to be a bit careful with them, uh, but they do close just as easy, but you can feel that they are very light. So you definitely don't want to force them. Um, but yeah, absolutely awesome. Working windows and working doors. Now the whole inside of the door trims uh, are all carbon fiber as well. So that's a really good feature. Uh, we'll look at the interior a little bit later. Uh, you do have Koenigsegg uh, Regera carbon panels on the door sill there. Uh, what shall we have a look at next? All right, let's open up the front hood. So the front hood has its own hinges. Just turn that back there. Uh, and it has a couple of extra struts on there, uh, like an auto art model would have. Um, that feels quite solid when you open it up. Uh, the whole underside is carbon fibre. Carbon fibre you can see on the sides there, all gloss. Uh, you do have your cargo area here for the roof. Uh, I did try, the roof does not fit in here. Uh, it has a larger, deeper section here. I know it does on the real car, but uh, I don't think you would want to try and force this piece in there anyway and scratch all that beautiful gloss carbon. So uh, the detail is exquisite. It's all carbon fibre everywhere. Uh, you can see there the uh, central windscreen wiper. Uh, and it's just carbon fibre everywhere on this model, all on the inside of the headlights. Yeah, really, really impressive. So the actual movement of that front hood is flawless. Just exactly the same as a die cast model would be, except it's much lighter. Alright, so that's the front hood. Now let's go to another treat at the back. As you can see, the rear wing here. Uh, this is a working rear wing. So I'm just going to use my little blade so that I can open this carefully. So I'll just use my fingers on this one. It is a little bit delicate because you've got to open both those wing legs at the same time. So sorry, it was a bit hard to show you with that one, um, but you can see that the, uh, let's do it that way, you can see that the wing legs move forward and prop up in that direction, and then you can also angle the uh, rear wing up for its air brake position as well. So that's pretty amazing that there's little delicate pieces there um, so another great feature of this model is that operating rear wing. So that's really impressive. And then I guess the next thing we will do, we'll open up the rear clam. So this does feel a little bit more delicate than the front. Uh, but once it's in its open position, uh, it feels fine. So again, carbon fiber decals everywhere. You can see underneath here, some of the pattern is a little bit wavy as well. So I guess that they've hydro dipped the underside of this engine cover, uh, but it doesn't really detract from the model. Uh, it's carbon fiber everywhere, all around the back here between the tail lights. Uh, and there's some exquisite engine detail in there as well. So really, really impressed with the level of detail and the level of carbon fiber on this model. Got all your triplex suspension system, shock absorbers, shock absorber reservoirs. Uh, it really is quite amazing. Not the easiest engine to see, quite frankly, because this rear clam is so big, um, but nonetheless, really, really impressive. So that is a model that has a lot of opening features. So let's just open it fully up. So we've got the opening front hood, opening doors, windows that roll down, rear clamshell that opens up, and rear working wing. So that is an amazing, amazing model. As I say, it's been quite a long time since I have really been amazed at a model. I've got plenty of nice models in the collection, high-end models, but uh, 
yeah, this is the first time in a long while that I've absolutely been just blown away with a model that I received. So really, really impressed on this one by Frontier. That sort of makes me want to buy more opening models from Frontier, although I can't really afford too many of these because they are such an expensive model. But let's have a look in the interior now. So as you can see, again, extensive use of carbon fibre all in the centre console, top of the dashboard, uh, the bit on the door trims, uh, the seats are red with a black insert, you do have Koenig seg mats on the floor, nice little gear shift paddles, all the air conditioning events are like the real car. Yeah, just absolutely blown away with the level of detail in this model. Nice bit of detail between the seats as well. So we've got the interior lighting. All the door sills are all in full carbon fibre. Yeah, it's just a carbon fibre overload, this model. Absolutely blown away. So yeah, that's pretty much uh, going to be it for today's review of this new Frontier Koenig Seg Regera full opening model in candy red and carbon. Uh, now if you want to grab one of these models, I believe that carmodels.com in Austria still has two of these in stock. Uh, and from what I see, he's got the best price worldwide for these models. Uh, so yeah, I would absolutely highly rate this model. Um, I'm going to give this a 9.5 out of 10. It's near perfect. Uh, there's a little bit of the wavy carbon pattern on some of the parts, as I mentioned. But that is the only thing I have an issue with on this model, and it's a very small issue at that. Um, as I say, it, it is just absolutely superb, this model, uh, and it, I'm proud to display this in my Koenigsegg display case with my other Koenigsegg models. So yeah, that's it for today's review. Um, if you haven't subscribed to the channel, why not subscribe? Uh, don't forget to smash that like button uh, and feel free to share this video. Uh, don't forget to follow me on social media as well, Facebook and Instagram. Links are on the homepage of this YouTube channel. Uh, and stay tuned. I've got a few more models on the way and uh, a few more from BBR and Auto Art as well. So I hope you enjoyed today's review of this stunning Frontier Koenigsegg Regera uh, model of the US car Cherry Bomb. Uh, I'm sure you're blown away as much as I am uh, with all these features on this model car, especially the windows that go up and down. Uh, that's just absolutely blown me away with this model. So if Frontier can do that with a resin model, um, a lot of other manufacturers should be doing it with their models as well. So that's it. Uh, don't forget to go and check out carmodels.com in Austria. Uh, huge range of resin and die cast models, a lot of high end models and some real special ones as well. So um, yeah, that's it for today's review. Uh, stay tuned, more videos on the way and thanks for watching Rob's Model Cars.